Hello, so this is a 52 inch uh, XPR4 display from 2008-2009. I believe that the TV cost around $3,000 or so at that point. Um, so what we see is that there is um, horizontal banding on the screen and it's intermittent. It doesn't happen all of the time. So it means that something is, um, it's not damaged, it's just loose or uh, something else to notice that if we move the display around, it might become better or worse, right? So it's fine now, but it'll appear again. Yeah, right. So all I've done is I've taken off the back of the TV. Um, the back is right there. I didn't have to disassemble the stand. It remains standing. This TV is very heavy, it's around uh, 100 pounds, but um, it can remain standing and we can remove the back first and then the front um, basal can be removed with, uh, by opening up the screws. So the screws are right there. Anyway, so let's have a look at this. Um, so through this uh, simple diagnosis, we find that um, there are little chips on each of these uh, ribbons and those chips are, they get really hot. So it's, it's actually impossible to touch them. It's at the back of these, you see? Uh, like that is one of the chips. This is one of the chips. And I believe that over time, um, as it keeps heating up, um, the, the flex ribbons, they slowly get, um, get um, they, yeah, they just lose their integrity. So for this particular display, as we can see that these, these black and lines that keep coming, they are linked to this one. And how I was able to find that was by um, basically touching each of them and then pressing them up. So apparently um, on this ribbon, there's, um, there's a connection at the bottom and there's a connection at the top. Now I don't have a press or anything like that, but um, it's this chip which seems to have become loose, I guess. Um, I do have a heat gun, but I'm not gonna take chances with that. I need to just apply some pressure here. So if you notice this, it's happening. It's happening. When I move it around, it happens, but as I press it, it's gone, right? It's gone, even if I shake it, it's gone, right? It's gone. If I remove it, it's happening. So this is the culprit for sure. And it's not the top or the bottom, look at that, right? So it's, it's glitchy and all, you press it from the top, it's still happening. as you press it at the, in the middle, it doesn't happen anymore. <sighs> so my thoughts are that to fix this, <clears throat> this is the front bezel. We have these little depressions in, in the front bezel. And I believe that these, these depressions are the ones that are supposed to press those chips maybe something like a heat sink, I guess. So my hope is that I'm gonna grab this. Uh, this is just a weather shield um, that I use to fix the doors. So I'm hoping that I'll just take this and I'm gonna put it at the back of each of these guys. Like, um, like that. And then as I fix it back on the TV, then hoping that as you see, it's happening again. It's gonna press this and get rid of the problem. And hopefully it might, um, yeah, it's, it might actually end up heating it more because foam is not a good conductor. I wish I had something that was like a metal foam, but anyway, so an old TV, so let it be like this. Okay, um, so that's it. Thank you.